Hello everybody, Hope Kids here. What is up you guys? This is my one year on YouTube. I, I don't know how the fuck I made it this far. And I mean it's really it's really big to me because, you know, I put a lot of time and determination into this channel and I mean honestly when I first made this channel I was a squeaky little bitch. I'm not going to lie, I was squeaky. I sounded I sounded terrible, but you know what? I still kept my determination. Um, at the beginning of the school year, so eight, I I think I started it beginning of eighth grade. Not positive, but um, one thing I do know is that school in eighth grade, I did not tell anybody about my YouTube channel because I did. Oh fuck! I did not want anybody to know about my YouTube channel. I just wanted. You know, people from online, people who actually watch YouTube, like me, indeed. But now, I honestly stopped giving a fuck. Like, when I go to school, I mean, there's at least 30 people who know about my YouTube channel. And, you know, it doesn't bother me anymore. So, I mean, I, my one friend, uh, he only has 30 subs on YouTube. But he ha he's been, <laughs> he's really fucking determined. I mean, five years... But I think it was like the first four, you didn't even post videos, I don't know, but five years on that one channel, I mean, Jesus Christ, that's a fucking streak, isn't it? Um, but, okay, but he wasn't afraid to tell people about his YouTube channel, and I have 1.7k, so I, I don't see why I shouldn't be afraid. I mean, everybody's like, I mean, everybody in my in my classes are like, yeah, I'm Facebook famous, and I could, I, I, like, in my mind, I would just think, oh, yeah, bitch, I'm YouTube famous, fucking bring it, I make pennies, <laughs> you, you make that lawnmower money, <laughs> but, you know, I, I, <laughs> that's how I thought of it in my brain at the first half of eighth grade, and then I, I just stopped giving a fuck, I just started posting all my videos on my Facebook page, don't even care if anybody fucking checked them, I mean, Every time I post something on Facebook, either it's fucking one like or two like. So, I mean, it's just like YouTube. Me and YouTube connect in Facebook, too. So, I mean, honestly, guys, when I... Sorry if you had to hear that fucking loud-ass truck. I mean, it's terrible. It is fucking terrible. I have my window open so I could get some fresh air. And so a homeless man could come and give me a fucking kiss. But, not just that, uh, what was it? Okay, yeah. Okay. So, honestly, guys, like, the last week or two, I've lost all of my real, I've really lost a lot of inspiration. I don't know what the fuck it was, but it was, I lost a lot of inspiration. That's why I probably wasn't posting as much. And then, magically, because probably that one year shit, it, it just hit me. I mean, I'm happy. I'm doing shit. I mean, you're not really going to see me play on my best of this kid account now that I have hope running perfect it's running great i love editing i mean um i'm pretty sh i got a lot of support on my edits i mean i wasn't expecting you guys to actually like those as much as i mean as much as i like editing because you know like if i break down my channel from beginning to start there is a lot of fucking history here like we're going back to the first videos ever so Honestly, first videos ever, I was a complete troll. Vanoss just hit a million subs. I was trying to copy Vanoss. Wasn't really growing. And honestly, this was when I was a squeaker and I would piss. But like when I get when I go back to earlier videos, all these videos have like 50 likes and shit. And I'm just like, what the fuck? <laughs> but, you know, they've been on for practically a year. So, I mean, it's just... It's really meaningful i mean so we're gonna break down my channel and this for oh 202 videos i'm not sure if that's correct but who knows so when i actually the first edit i ever had done was my 400 subscriber montage community montage there's a fucking fly one second i don't know if i got the bitch but um my first montage i ever made was a 400 subscriber community new montage. Actually, I think I made a 300 one. I'm not positive. But in that process, um, 
I don't know what it was. I wasn't really... I was really into GTA 5. I mean, me and my friends, I had my own little group. Practically a crew. So, I mean, you know, we were, we were funny. I mean, we had our moments. So, I mean, I really enjoyed it back in the day. I mean, I had fucking awesome. And then I finally got into... I got into trick shotting, and I made Black Ops 2 trail to a kill cam on first one ever, and that one actually did really good. It got 22 likes and 2 dislikes, and I was just like, what the fuck? But, you know, I mean, <laughs> I mean that one really made me shit myself, and I was just like, no fucking way. So, I was going to post more of that, but of course, like myself, I forgot. And then... I still posted trolls. I love trolling people. I mean, I was always the big Minnesota Burns friend. And then I I got this great idea because I found out how you could change your subscribers to, like, easily you could change your subscribers to 5 million, 10 million, 30 million, anything you wanted. So I decided to make a video of saying I have more subscribers than PewDiePie. And, of course, of fucking course, this video gets... So much fucking hate. I don't like. I don't know if you guys are fans of PewDiePie. I don't know, but I don't care. But a lot of PewDiePie's fans get pissed at people for making like a little prank video about it. Honestly, if PewDiePie was to watch that video, I guarantee you he would enjoy. He wouldn't fucking hate on it. He'd just be like, he'd just be like, ha ha ha. He wouldn't be like, oh my god, you're a fucking prick. You are a complete douchebag. You're not bigger than PewDiePie. Nobody's bigger than PewDiePie. Well, no fucking shit. God, you don't need to fucking tell me. I know he's the biggest. He has 30 mil. You don't need to fucking tell me this shit. Fuck. And then I hit 500 subs. Halfway to 1,000 on February 22nd, 2014. Now, that's fucking so many months ago <laughs> and then for the next like two weeks my channel was all minecraft so I, I don't know what the hell it got into me and then I didn't upload from February 1st to January 14th I mean no from January 14th to February 1st sorry I'm going down the list and pretty much what happened there is where I got my new gaming computer my old one broke down on me and I was fucking pissed I was like what the fuck no bad computer but you know it worked out it worked out four months in and then I I started thinking of these vi I started thinking of ways to help other people grow because honestly I I just quit I just quit caring how much I grew I wanted to help other people so but always I mean, there, there are people that I've known since the first channel I have ever made. I don't even know if it's still up, but if it is, dude, that's an old-ass channel. Like, that was easily four years ago. And then... Oh, shit. And then here comes the faithful day where my channel hits 1,600 subs in uh, a day. A day. A day. Okay, so, if you guys do not know what the hell happened, it was, I am Wildcat, congratulations on 1 million subscribers. So, what happened there was, I made a video, and I honestly, I really do love Wildcat, he's a great guy, he's really funny. So, I mean, I made that video because I really do enjoy him. And, of course, when I get home from school, guess what I see? I, I, I refresh my page, it says 1,300 subscribers, and I'm looking at it, and I'm like, no, this is a glitch. And then I was talking to my friends, I was like, yeah, YouTube's glitched out, it says I, has, it says I have 1,300 subs. And then, um, and then he's like, well, just click on the subscribers, and then I clicked on it, and then it said I had 1,350, and then every, like, time I refreshed it, I'd have a new subscriber, and I was just like, I was fucking pilled. I was building up shit in my pants, so, you know, I mean, I flipped shit, and then pretty much every video around that got big, like, the, my stunt montage got eight, uh, 800 views, Gmod Prop Hunt, and uh, Cleveland Plays Black Ops 2, those got pretty big around it, 1v1 Troll, and then, 
yeah, I, I was pretty much doing that, doing my own thing. And then here comes two months. No. Too early, too early. Three months. See? Three months. Nope, two months. I was right. I was right. See? Okay. Okay, and then I went on half a soup for a week, had all the video schedule uploaded for you guys, um, all that fun baloney, and then I made a video of that. I don't know if you guys enjoyed it. I don't know if I get to go on it this year, but if I do, I'm fucking going. Give it those 35 miles of hell. I will go. Um, then I got back into Minecraft for some stupid fucking reason. And then I started... And then I started realizing, why is PewDiePie so big? Well, the reason he is so big is because he mixes up the games on his channel, and obviously he's fucking hilarious. This fucking fly. Oh no, that no, that's a fly. That is a fucking fly. Okay, but um, is because he mixes up the games on his video. So I started posting Outlast, but of course nobody on my channel likes scary games. They don't like to get scared. I don't like to get fucking scared. It's a fact. I mean, I hate that shit. I don't like it when a big fucking brute comes out and tries to beat the shit up. Ah. Beats the shit out of me. Mm -mm. No. But, then, uh, one of my... I was just looking up random shit, and then it says, Play this new fun game, Miley's Twerk Ball. And of course, I don't know if you guys ever want to see it, but I got the world record on that game, for any of you who don't know. Got 251. Fuck yeah, don't, don't try to beat my record. That's a proud monument right there. But... Um, that video actually did really well, and then I got made a video that said how to get 1,000 subscribers, and that got views, but I keep on getting comments saying, sub for sub, bro, sub for sub, and I'm just like, no, that's not the way, and then I did best render settings, because, you know, and then I actually did, um, I did a 1.7k montage when I was still at 1.6k. But, you know, I felt like uploading it, even though those were the shittiest clips in the world. Also, one of my most popular videos, not, well, one of my new most popular videos that has actually shown up on a lot of community channels. Actually, a lot of you might have subscribed from community channels because of this video was the fake Van Ostrol. Um, I don't know if, I mean, if you guys have a community channel and you guys want to upload it, just comment on the video and I'll, I'll give you permission. As long as you just give me permission, I doesn't bother me so and then I was still doing everything all of that stuff and then I got into editing I don't know what the fuck it was but it hit me it was like you need to edit bitch get into the world of editing and then made introducing hope kids I got fucking struck from hell of dislikes and then I made the stupid video of I might quit YouTube blah 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 and of course, I already made a video of that. I was stupid when I made that. I did lose some subscribers. But you know, I might gain them back in the future. You never know. So and Then I was still doing Among the Sleeve, Gmod, all of that stuff. Still editing because of course I enjoy editing. It is fun. And then I realized when I started playing Call of Duty because I am I am in hope and... I, I have, I, I, well, I don't have to go for clips, but I, I enjoy going for clips because I enjoy making episodes and I enjoy editing my episodes and all that fun shit. So, intermixing with that, I decided to go with raid, like, because every time, I don't know if you guys are trick shotters or feeders, but you know, as soon as you hit marker, your tomahawk flies past a bitch's face, or when you die, right before you're about to kill him. You get pissed at the game. Everybody gets pissed at a game. Doesn't matter which game it is. Everybody gets frustrated with the game. You cannot fucking tell me once in your life you have never screamed at a fucking game. I will fucking choke you out with a fucking noose. You don't know. You always rage at a game. It does not matter which fucking game. It does not fucking matter. But, um, and then I figured out that I can intermix that with life stories that I hate shit people like I don't know and then of course how do I miss that fucking fly every time but okay let's pass the point um also if you've made it this far this is also what's going on is I am giving away the Roxio I said I would give it away on today August 27th 
2014, the day this channel hits one year on YouTube. One year. Congratulations, boys. We fucking made it. The troopers that have been here since day one and have stayed here since day one, thank you so much. I mean, really means a lot to watch, to see how you have. And out of the whole year, I've uploaded 200 videos. I mean, that's pretty fucking good. I mean, I'm not going to lie. One whole year? I mean, I probably can't pull a video or two videos every year. <laughs> you got <laughs> you got a lot of wishing to do if you want me to do that. Fuck. Um, but, um, yeah, I mean, I was just doing that shit, and I was having fun. And now um, I was getting a whole bunch of comments later on saying, Oh, you're never going to give it away. So, I mean, the winner is D Jones 12 I'm... Let me read his comment. He commented on the newest newest fucking video. Let me read his fucking name. I'll, I know him since three white kids, like literally the beginning of three white kids. Um, I don't know if you guys came from that channel or not, but that channel is old as shit. That that's easily a two year old channel. But I I guess I left on that channel and I came to this channel, and it's actually succeeding a lot better than it did than three white kids did. But 312 Jones, D Jones, as I remember it. Um, add me on Skype. My Skype will be in the description for you, man. If you've actually made it this far, I will comment uh, saying D Jones, you won. But D Jones, um, just find my Skype in the description, and then you can add me on Skype. And then you, you're going to have to send me your ad address so I can send the Roxio to you because... Um, like you're gonna have to send me your whole address, not just a itty bitty bit of information, not just like three seven nine. No, it has to be the whole address, so I can get it to the correct person. Um, all that because I mean, you guys don't fucking believe me, and I guarantee you, when he, I, this isn't a fake account, you think I'd make fake fucking subs? No. And all of you people that have said I sub bot, you go ahead and believe what you think. But why the fuck would I pay money to have somebody subscribe to my channel when I could just do what I want and have somebody watch it and subscribe? If you guys don't believe me, then go watch the I Am Wildcat video. You'll see a blank fucking thing right there that says, I Am Wildcat. And you will look at that, and it will say, 1 million subs. And then you'll look at yourself in the mirror, and you'll be like, Okay, it's 9.30. Not 10, 9.30. And you will look at yourself in the mirror, and you will wonder what the fuck you're looking at. So, um, yeah, all that shit. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you for one year on YouTube. D. Jones, you have been an amazing person. I mean, you've stayed here since day one on YouTube for this account. That is a fucking trooper. That's a super trooper. Like, I mean, there's troopers, super troopers, all that shit, and... All the people at my school, if you've actually made it this far, 18 minutes in, um, yeah, just, you know, hit me up at school, fucking smack me in the face, elbow me in the stomach, whatever you want. Um, hello, buddy, I mean, yeah, I mean, what the fuck am I doing, but I gotta get to editing, and peace out, sexies. Yeah.